Please, Chitrai, I can explain. The latest batch of cultists knew nothing of the Astral Prism. They were just trying to find Moonrise. They all head there. My Gish have drafted plans to assault the tower. They are ready to fight, Chitrai. We could sift the missing artifact from the tower's ashes if you would give us... Quiet. Find the astral prism, Therizin. My patience falters. Yes, Chirai. You heard him! Go! Do as she says. She remains your Kithrak. For now. familiar to me, Rastil. Do you bring news of the weapon? It is small, angular, metal, adorned with Tirsu script, stolen by true soul heretics. You sense Shadowheart's worry. This weapon sounds like the artifact you carry. What was that look? You know something. Do you have it? I sincerely hope you know what you're doing. Shema is Allah Give it to me. as described. The Inquisition will finally come to an end. it when I cannot? It appears you have been chosen, Vin Isk. How lucky you are. Take the weapon yourself, then. Seek the Chupri below. Keep away from me! The Inquisitor awaits. Follow the corridor. I suppose you've noticed I'm not terribly fond of wolves. I've always been terrified of them, ever since I was a child. I showed you my memory of when I was lost in the woods. It could hardly come as a surprise. The Mother Superior wasn't above using it against me. 
If I disobeyed, sometimes instead of a whipping, she'd threaten to drag me to a wolf den. Never failed to bring me back in line. Why is it always the bad memories I can still recall? In any case, I'll be keen to avoid them. You're unlike the Mother Superior, then. Maybe that's what I like about you. You're different. Madness. Quickly then. The Inquisitor will be waiting. We must hurry. I'll breathe easier once we're gone from here. This Inquisitor sounds like a real piece of work. Do you think he'll answer our questions? Inquisitor may guide us. Do not provoke him. We must speak. I can tell you more than any amount of skulking around. Come, speak. Interesting. My Ardents reported that an Istic survived the crashed Geek slave vessel. You have accomplished much since. I'm pleased to finally meet you. I heard there is so much goblin blood on your hands that it soaks their children's nightmares. To business. I suspect you plucked something precious from the Geek ship. Something that belongs to us. The weapon. Give it to me. Don't do it. The weapon is how I protect you.
I expected a little of Istic education, but here we kneel before our queen. Your choice of allies is most vexing. They do not become you, Blazel. Jamar Zala Vlaketh, you know me. Erlon of Kalia speaks most highly, as did Archaia before. You seek purity. I may yet grant it. which is ours. But are you friend, or are you thief? Unexpected servant, your will is strong. Your kind will go far for glory, as you have shown by being here. Extend your fealty one step further, and you will be rewarded beyond your mortal reckoning. That weapon, the astral prison, it is corrupted. I will cleanse it for you, my queen. Tell me how. There is someone inside. Their mind is warped, broken. A blight! They are an agent of the Grand Design, sent to sabotage the Astral Prism. Our last defense against the return of the Elithid Empire! to the artifact. Be wary of the creature's lying tongue. Cut it out if you must. Well, war gas, they are not to leave until it is done. As you say, my queen. Chmar Zala Vlaketh. We will not waste a second.
do it. Dangerous things often are. Consider me intrigued. So you came, in spite of all my warnings. Disappointing. But it is not you I wish to speak with. Send in the one in charge, alone. You are not the one I wish to speak with. I will only have words with the one you answer to. Alone. All right, what now? Come, we will talk in private, just the two of us. I told you to stay away from the Githyanki, but you just couldn't help yourself, could you? And now... You've come here to murder me. Blackith wants me dead because I know her secret. It is a secret so great that if her people ever found out, that would be the end of her rule, the end of her. That same secret is how I've been protecting you from the Absolute. Vlakith warned you that I would try to deceive you, 
But consider this. What reason have I to deceive you? I want the same thing as you. Freedom. I'm on your side. I have been since the very beginning. I protect you, that I saved you, that I'm just like you. If this was not enough to convince you, what more is there to say? It seems I was right to put my faith in you after all. Thank you. Blackith will be furious. To make no mention of your Githyanki companion. The Lich Queen fears nothing more than the loss of her empire. The knowledge I have of her deception will bring that about. She is trying her very best to kill me by sending you. Vlakith is lying to her people. She pretends to know how Gith destroyed the Mind Flayer Empire. In truth, she knows nothing. If the Illithid Empire were ever to return, she would be incapable of stopping them. And if her people found out about her impotence, there would be mutiny, revolution, the end of her rule. But that very power, the power to resist illithid control, which Blackith only pretends to know, is how I've been protecting you. I suppose she hoped to extract it from my corpse. Since you spared me that fate, she will come for you. question, but you're not ready for the answer. I have delayed long enough. The next attack is overdue, and I can't risk you being caught in the middle of it. I need you out there, searching for the Absolute. You were on the right path to Moonrise Towers. Return to it. I hope you are ready to face Blackith's wrath. The entire crash stands ready to kill you in her name. Good luck. You're back. What happened in there? Speak. Have you killed my queen's enemy? you not to trust the one inside. Your mind tingles. Lysel seeks entrance. Your thoughts become one. She sees the truth of your confrontation in an instant. Blacketh Tafkinazin. I see you. Only madness. Blackith bears the full might of Tunarath's arms and the covenant of the great mother Gith. Skvar! We are leaving this place now.
you are named Hashalak. Bend your head, for my blade is ready. Shrai, please, summon Vlakith. There's much... Irrelevant, Gake wretch. The Queen has spoken. Your death is decreed. You realize what Lazel doesn't. Whatever the outcome of your visit to the Astral Prism, Vlakith had no intention of letting either of you live. Yilik, with me, to the death. As you came to your senses. Now leave before the others come for us.
time. One true way. The Inquisitor will be waiting. We must hurry. I'll breathe easier once we're gone from here. This Inquisitor sounds like a real piece of work. Do you think he'll answer our questions? The Inquisitor may guide us. Do not provoke him. I can tell you more than any amount of skulking around. Come. Speak. Interesting. My Ardens reported that an Istic survived the crashed Geich slave vessel. You have accomplished much since. I'm pleased to finally meet you. I heard there is so much goblin blood on your hands that it soaks their children's nightmares. To business. I suspect you plucked something precious from the Geik ship. Something that belongs to us. The weapon. Give it to me. Don't do it. The weapon is how I protect you. The Geik are about to execute their grand design and you seek to bargain. Pahakva! The weapon. Now! The grand design is what all Geek seek. The restoration of the Illithid Empire, which spanned the entirety of the multiverse. For centuries there, elder brains sought to bring back their dominion. Every plot they hatched, we stopped. But now they are close to succeeding. Never before could they pause Ceremorphosis. Never before could they let the infection spread undetected. You saw the thralls gathered on the Geek ship. Imagine that everywhere. Wants, needs, choice. All would cease to be. Everything rendered unto the Geek. So, the weapon. Please. 
Don't give it to him. No! So, it is fun. Istic education. But here we kneel before our queen. Your choice of allies is most vexing. They do not become you, Blazel. servant. Your will is strong. Your kind will go far for glory, as you have shown by being here. Extend your fealty one step further, and you will be rewarded beyond your mortal reckoning. That weapon, the astral prison, it is corrupted. Gained, a burden born. 
You must accept. Refuse, and you will know my fury. Use the Planecaster's power to enter the artifact. Be wary of the creature's lying tongue. Cut it out if you must. Rewargas, they are not to leave until it is done. As you say, my queen. Shma Zala Flaketh. We will not waste a second. Don't do it! Dangerous things often are. Within reach. So you came, in spite of all my warnings. Disappointing. But it is not you I wish to speak with. I will only speak with the one in charge. You are not the one I wish to speak with. I will only have words with the one you answer to. Alone. Talk in private. Just the two of us. I may have made a mistake trusting you. I told you to stay away from the Githyanki, but you just couldn't help yourself. Could you? And now... You've come here to murder me. <clears throat> I told you I stole the artifact from someone. Well, 
I stole it from Vlakin. Since then, she has become desperate. Vlakith wants me dead because I know her secret. It is a secret so great that if her people ever found out, that would be the end of her rule, the end of her. That same secret is how I've been protecting you from the Absolute. I can hear your thoughts. You think I'm lying. Vlakith warned you that I would try to deceive you. But consider this. What reason have I to deceive you? I want the same thing as you. Freedom. I'm on your side. I have been since the very beginning. It seems I was right to put my faith in you after all. Thank you. Lakith will be furious, to make no mention of your Githyanki companion. The Lich Queen fears nothing more than the loss of her empire. The knowledge I have of her deception will bring that about. She is trying her very best to kill me, by sending you. Vlakith is lying to her people. She pretends to know how Gith destroyed the Mind Flayer Empire. In truth, she knows nothing. If the Illithid Empire were ever to return, she would be incapable of stopping them. And if her people found out about her impotence, there would be mutiny, revolution, the end of her rule. But that very power, the power to resist illithid control, which Vlakith only pretends to know, is how I've been protecting you. I suppose she hoped to extract it from my corpse. Since you spared me that fate, she will come for you. A logical question. But you're not ready. For the answer. I have delayed long enough. The next attack is overdue, and I can't risk you being caught in the middle of it. I need you out there, searching for the Absolute. You were on the right path to Moonrise Towers. Return to it. Be warned. The Inquisitor awaits your return from this place with orders to kill you. No doubt the rest of the Kresh will join him. Good luck. killed my queen's enemy. Vlakith does not lie to her faithful. Open your mind. Show me. Your mind tingles. Lysel seeks entrance. Your thoughts become one. She sees the truth of your confrontation in an instant. Vlakith Tafkinazin. I see only... only madness. Vlakith bears the full might of Tunarath's arms, and the covenant of the Great Mother Gith. We must go to the Chirai. He will summon Vlakith. She must know of this... this apostate!
Someone's hiding here. This does. Lazel, I've been waiting. You are named Hashalak. Bend your head, for my blade is ready. Shirai, please, summon Vlaketh. There's much... Irrelevant, geek wretch. The Queen has spoken. Your death is decreed. You realize what Lazel doesn't. Whatever the outcome of your visit to the Astral Prism, Vlakith had no intention of letting either of you live. With me, to the death! Now this 
is my happy place. you came to your senses. Now leave, before the others come for us. another round. Go time.
On the move. Fresh. Vlaketh. Vlaketh. I have wielded your fury as a blade, roared your wrath as a dragon. You promised ascension, yet I crawl among my own people, low as an asp's belly. I followed your path. What good? This heart of stone for it to be shattered. She tests me. A trial of faith. Kalir prepared me. Only the heaviest souls soar to the astral. Yes. Yes. I might gain Vlaketh's favor yet. Silence! I must think. 